Hey guys, this is going to be a quick tutorial and in this one we will be just uh, reducing the size of our image before sending it to or uploading it to a server, okay? So the uploading part we had already done in one of my previous tutorials on, on you know, uploading image via retrofit. If you want to check that out also, you can check that out after this, uh, after we reduce the size. I'll have the link in the description somewhere. Okay, so now let's get on how we can actually reduce the size of the image or scale down the image. So what we had done is we have this upload image method here, method or function. This one is right here. And in here, what we were doing is we were loading the image from the gallery or we had taken it from camera and that is, this is the file path where it is saved. And we were then converting that, uh, that file into multi-part body like this and then we were just sending it or uploading it to server via retrofit okay so now what we were doing is instead of directly sending this image or directly converting this image into multi-part data what we will do is first we will reduce the size of this image now how to do that now in here what we have done is we have directly uh, you know loaded this image image path as a file so if that is loaded as a file we cannot scale down the image so what we need to do is we need to load it, load it as an image so we'll delete this so as you can see here what we do is we use bitmap factory to load bitmap from path okay so instead of loading that as a file we will load it as, a, as an image so to do that how we can do is we can do bitmap uh, full size bitmap is let's say we load it using bitmap factory decode yeah it's decode file and then we go file name we write the file path here okay so now we have our bitmap that we want to resize okay so now we have done this part okay this is done and now we need to scale down the bitmap so how do you scale down the bitmap? Okay, now there are multiple ways to do the, do it, but I have a I have created a utility utility class as image resizer. So I'll have this. Uh, you can download this class. I'll uh, have the GitHub link in the description. Okay, so check that out. So the easy way is let's say that's a library or whatever. You just go image resizer, right, and then. Uh, you don't want to generate thumb size you want to reduce bitmap size and you just pass the full size bitmap and then you write the maximum resolution so it's like let me open the calculator so if you want a 1920 by 1080 uh, uh, or 1080 into 1920 image so that is like 1080 by 1920 so if you want to image to be 1080 by 920 then you pass this into your second parameter that is the resolution or what is it um, maximum size so but if you pass this size it's not actually reduced so you know let's pass a more number much lower than this let's say you want your image to be 600 by 400 okay so here you can pass 240 thousand right so that becomes the max size of your max resolution of your image you know just just pass uh, width multiplied by height of your image in pixels so this much should be pretty fine and this uh, this size should be pretty uh, small and your uploads will be pretty pretty fast so what you do is you get a new bitmap here reduced bitmap okay now you can open this here and check what i'm doing here it's not uh, anything complex you know it's pretty simple and if you if you want to know what it is you can just ask me in the description below uh, sorry ask me in the comment section below i'll just let you know okay so now you have our reduced bitmap now what you need to do is you need to convert this into a file so that you can you know convert the file into multi-part file data so to do that what you can do is uh, you just do you just convert this into a, a file so to do that 
you need let's say we, we create another method to do that okay and first just name the method here let's just first name the method so that we don't just go with the flow so let's say uh, get bitmap file here and then here we pass our reduce bitmap comma reduce bitmap dot okay let's just pass the reduce bitmap here okay now let's create this method that will actually convert this reduce save this reduce bitmap to a file and then we'll use that file to you know uh, send it to the server okay so what we can do is first we create a file it's just null at the moment and then we just equals to you know, let's not add null here directly initialize here it's a new file and environment dot get external storage directory okay and then you just go file dot separator what is plus you need you need to give the file name so what we can do is we can get the file name from the bitmap I'm sorry I don't think you can get the file name from the bitmap you just get the file name from uh, your file so what we can do is we can just write reduced file here at the moment you can choose to you know give it a timestamp or whatever otherwise you know your reduced file will be replaced all the time okay so that is the file name and then what you do is you go file dot create new file And then you create a byte array output stream because we'll be writing and then what's new better upstream. Okay, this is not actually the okay, yeah. This is the reduce bitmap. And then you compress it and the format is you can choose any format according to your uh, you know your file I'll choose JPEG and then just do the following okay and then you convert it into byte array And then you create a file output stream you know just basic java file operation stuff where is the file let me pass the file here okay i think you need, you need this in try catch yes just click here and then click control and alt enter and then sorry I hit alt enter and then surround it with try catch and then finally you can just write to it write bitmap data okay I'll just make it generic I'm making this generic is not a good practice but you know just gotta get done with this quickly and then you just flush it and close it okay and then you return your file that's it but since this is void you'll get an error just go to go to the error then hit control alt enter again and then make it return whatever that you want to return okay so why am i 
okay there's an error here also let's just move this to this try and catch too okay now you're done okay now you go here and then you get a file with the file reduced file okay you so this is the important method right so because you're converting the reduced bitmap to file here okay now we have the file and then you just you just do whatever you use this file to send it to the server okay so this is it so what we did is first we loaded the bitmap from the path and then we reduce the image uh, bitmap image size using this image resizer utility class uh, you can download this from the github okay and then we saved that bitmap into a file and then we uh, got that file and then we used that reduced file to upload the file to the server okay that's it if you have any questions let me know in the comment section below and if i helped you just you know hit like and subscribe help the channel